Hello ladies and gentlemen, for today's video I headed over to the mall nearby and decided to film a video in our local grocery store. So I plopped myself down by this new sushi conveyor belt they built in and asked if I could film before starting by applying my primer to my face and then I applied a bit of the stick foundation by Revolution Makeup. I didn't put it all over my face the way I usually would because I don't have my dual fiber brush with me. I only have my beauty blender so I put it under my eyes on my forehead and around my mouth before going over the same areas with my concealer to just mix the two colors together a bit. This is how I would apply my concealer if I'm just doing concealer and not foundation. It's just a little bit more so it's kind of in between just concealer and like a full face of foundation and concealer. So then I use my beauty blender to blend everything out. And at this point I got told I have to hurry up and get out of there because you know makeup, buy food, it could be an issue, people might not like it, which you know is a legit concern. So I like sped up real fast and quickly got my setting powder all over my face so I can get started and get done and get out of there. Next I moved on to my eyebrows so I brushed them out. So I picked up some powder on an eyeliner brush and started drawing in my eyebrows but the guy was rushing me along and I started feeling bad for being there. So I hurried up and kind of overshot my eyebrows, you're gonna see in a bit there extended a bit more than I would usually make them but you gotta do what you gotta do and you gotta work with what you've got. And I have to say I haven't been this nervous filming a random places video in a while because typically I'm in places where no one else is there, no one really talks to me while I'm doing it, they just kind of watch. Here I was sitting by someone's workstation and even though I did ask, I thought it would be fine to be there, he ended up changing his mind and rushing me so I quickly zoomed through what I could do. Next, I started lining my lips with this NYX lip pencil. It's a pink color so that I have guidelines to work with. And then I kind of colored it in for the most part so that I don't have to worry about lipstick too much. Even though I did go in with a lighter lipstick shade in the middle to just create that bit of definition in my lips. I was a little shy here when it came to like showing what makeup I'm using because since I'm being rushed I didn't want to be too obvious that I'm making a video. But I picked up my little Wet n Wild palette, picked up a nude color and used it to set underneath my eyelids and on my eyelids as well a bit more to make sure I'm not going to have any creasing. And then for some reason I moved on to blush next instead of eyeshadow and I'm using my broken one when I do random places tutorials because I don't want to risk breaking my other one that I got and I got told to hurry up again and I wish I could kind of just opt out and film this another time in another place or something but I didn't really have another time anytime soon I'd be able to film this video and I was ready this far so I was like you know just push through hurry up get out of there and mind you I was out of there in 16 minutes I pretty much did a full face in 16 minutes which actually I was quite impressed by in hindsight but here I was just applying my favorite highlighter all over my face and all the typical areas cupid's bow nose under my brows and my tear ducts all that jazz and then I finally moved on to eyeshadow I'm not even sure what color I picked up here on my fluffy blending brush. I'm thinking it's a warm tone transition color and I just quickly washed that into my crease to get this started. I then used a flat yet still fluffy brush to apply that same color on my lower lash line and then I used that same brush to apply a warm tone nude color on my lid. And I actually had like a dramatic plan in mind of something I wanted to do but all of that went straight out the window when I was rushed. Here I picked up a beautiful shimmery pink color from my Carly Bible palette and applied it all over my lid. The theme was kind of pink because I was wearing a pink sweater. That's what I kind of went for. This is something I've done before when in a rush so I defaulted on that. To brighten it up a bit I put a silver color in my waterline to help open up my eyes a bit and then I quickly curled my lashes because no matter what rush I am in five minute makeup challenge or not I gotta curl my lashes before putting on some mascara I'm using this one by essence and just loading it up because even if I had false lashes they would not have been time and then here I was like, you know, should I do eyeliner, should I not? And I gave in and decided to do it. And I've never in my life drawn eyeliner wings this quickly. I literally slapped them on. So not the best, but they're there. So I'm proud. It reminded me a lot of how my sister does eyeliner. She does it in the car. But then that is the final result. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again next time. Bye!